What's going on, guys? I'm here with James Charles. Clock at the house, Clock girl. At the house, girl. Clock at the house. <laughs> Bye. Oh, wait, are we so excited for Jeffrey? I'm like, oh my gosh. Pumped. I never wear pink, so I'm like yeah. a little bit scared of this outfit, but there'd only be one person that I wear it for. Yeah. Sister's time. Love you. Bye, Jeffrey. What's going on, everyone? It's Rich Lux. In today's video, girl, you won't believe the drama. Oh, honey, gotta fix this little contour because we got all this drama, girl. Get your setting sprays ready. <sighs> oh, yeah, I forgot to tell y'all. Okay, so for the giveaway, remember the Her Mannerisms Lippies? I'll announce the winner at the end of the video. So, you wanna talk? I feel like we need to talk. Let's talk. Okay, so I freaking met James Charles, and it was a moment. Now, I already know. I already know. You're gonna be those people. You didn't meet James Charles. You're a liar. And they're gonna say how it's all green screen and it's all fake and all that stuff. I, I can never win. I can never win. But I have the receipts, girl. Let me show you right here. Get my receipts in the bag. What's going on, guys? I'm here with James Charles. Clock at the house, Clock girl. At the house, girl. Clock at the house. <laughs> Bye. Wait, are we so excited for Jeffrey? Like, I'm oh my gosh. Pumped. I never wear pink, so I'm like yeah. a little bit scared of this outfit, but there'd only be one person that I wear it for. Yeah. Sister's time. Love you. Bye, Jeffrey. Okay, there you have it. That was the rest. That was the proof. That was not a James Charles look. They'll, they'll still say that was a clone. James Charles clone. That was an impersonator. No. That was the real James Charles, and I, I'm pretty sure if you ask James Charles, he will confirm that was him in the house, guys, okay? So, let me tell you how it happened, and I'll tell you the real tea, okay? So, I got invited to the Jeffree Star Morphe event in Los Angeles, California, right? So, you, know, you guys know I live in Houston, okay? And then, I was in the hotel room, and it was time to go, so I got a car service take me there, I got to the event, we're walking in, and I remember this big Mercedes-Benz SUV pulled up behind us and then the door opened up and I heard like music you know what I'm saying like pop 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 you know music and I turn around and it kind of looked like James Charles but there's like a lot of people in the party bus so I don't know who it was right and I remember I just it was really cold too outside and I walked in and then I heard James Charles rich Lux. I like and I looked I was like what what? That's James Charles the house. And I thought to myself, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Like, okay, she's gonna sue me the house. This is it. She's gonna she's gonna say, How dare you? And just like slap me in the face or something. There's gonna be drama. Because I have made countless videos on James Charles. James Charles is canceled. James Charles can't do makeup. James Charles this, James Charles that. You know what I'm saying? Like just like funny little videos, or whatever. Uh anyway. And then we reviewed his palette. And then, you know, it was just like, I was like, that's it. He's going to come. He's going to serve me papers. He's going to threaten to sue me. Like, he saw all my videos I made about him. I'm pretty sure he has. So he comes up to me, and I'm just like, I'm waiting for it. You know, I was like, damn. You know, like, and I was like, I'm waiting for it. Like, and I was waiting for it. I was like, damn, here's my frick. It's all over. It's all over, right? So he's like, Rich Lux, oh my gosh. And then he gives me, like, a warmest hug ever. And I was like, oh my gosh. He's actually a nice person, right? And then, so he has like this whole entourage of people, right? There's like beautiful girls, beautiful guys. They're all with him, beautiful people in the house. And I'm just like, Ugh. You, you know, I don't know how to explain it. And I was like, can we do a Snapchat? So that's when we did the Snapchat thing or Instagram thing. Yeah, Instagram story thing. Let me show it to you, here we go. What's going on guys? I'm here with James Charles. Clock at the house, Clock girl. At the house girl. Clock at the motherfucking house. <laughs> Bye. Wait, are we so excited for Jeffrey? Like, I'm oh literally my most gosh. I never wear pink, so I'm like yeah. a little bit scared of this outfit, but there'd only be one person that I wear it for. Yeah. Sister's time. Love you. Bye, Jeffrey. So yeah. So then after that, he him and his crew, they went through security. There was like three levels of security, right? Like one, two, three. And then it was like a checkpoint, checkpoint, checkpoint. So he was ahead of me. And so when we finally made it to the top up there, we're at the party. We're at the Morphe event party, right? We're kind of waiting for things to get like, you know, popping off or whatever, you know? And so James Charles was there at the party. I think he, he hung out like majority of the time. Like I totally thought James Charles was going to go in, walk around, we're out. You know what I'm saying? No, he hung out the whole time. He stayed. He enjoyed it. It was super cool. And I really found him to be down to earth. 
He took a picture with everybody who wanted to like want a, a photo with him. He wasn't like bougie or stuck up. And I was like, this is a James Charles that I've never seen. Like, I've, you, all, you know how you always hear stuff, you know? But to actually see it in your face, I was like, this guy is totally genuine and totally sweet person. Like, he's like a real person. And it's kind of weird, you know what I'm saying? But it wasn't one of those moments where like you meet somebody and they're putting on a mask. It, it seemed genuine. And then like my people that are with me, they got to meet him and they were like saying the same thing, right? So meeting James Charles was more than what I expected. I was not even expecting to meet James Charles that night. And I did. And I'm and me, I'm surprised he even knew who I was. I, I was just shocked. I was just shocked by the whole moment because he easily could have went by and snubbed me. He easily could have just been like, girl, not bothered the house. But he was totally cool with it. And I think that most importantly, I think that he understands like the gig, you know? Like he understands like the humor and satire behind it all, which that just means like the most, like it says a lot more about him. Like it says a lot about yourself when you're able to like laugh at yourself, that, that kind of thing. So I was like, oh my gosh. That was freaking crazy to sit here and make videos about somebody and then you actually freaking finally run into them. It's like, oh my gosh, like I've actually met you. Wow. You know, so that was a cool thing. And I just like feel really happy about it. And it was like nothing but positive vibes and energy and like all that good stuff. You know, you already know there's more James Charles drama the house because he posted on Twitter. Girl, here's what he said. Apparently my sex tape is going around. This is exciting news to me, considering I'm still very much a virgin. Bringing this back because apparently it's going around again. So there's James Charles sex tape going around, I guess. No, no. Well, he went on Snapchat and here's what he said about it. Here we go. Also, just to clarify and address this one last time, because my name is currently trending worldwide on Twitter again, um, there is a video going around that is a sex tape and people are convinced that it is my sex tape. It's not, unfortunately for me, um, as much as I would love it to be. I am still a virgin. Uh, it is just another normal gay couple whose face was censored out. I know it looks like me. I literally was shocked when I first saw it, being like, oh my God, what is going on here? Um, it is not me. Um, and I'm sure the couple in the video does not want it shared around either. So please stop and relax with that. Uh, if my sex tape ever does leak, you guys will know because I'll be posting it everywhere and it'll be fully monetized. <laughs> Oh, uh, he shut it down. Okay, first of all, love James Charles so much, but I don't, I don't know if I could watch sex tape James Charles' house. Like, no, you know what I'm saying? I want a man, honey. I want a muscular, masculine man in the house. And it, I couldn't even picture that. So the video going around has like this people's face and it's blurred and they're saying it's James and it's not. Which he confirmed it's not. And I just, I mean, I don't know, girl. I just, I can't. I, I, don't, I don't believe it. And it's true, if there was one out, he would probably have like a freaking launch party for the sex tape, girl. You know what I'm saying? The whole nine. And you know, it'd be about $30, $40 just to watch the damn little movie. You remember that? All the whole drama with Paris Hilton and Kim Kardashian. It would be very much that, girl. Very much the house. So I'm glad that uh, <laughs> there's, one not, there's one not out there. All right. So let me know what you think about all that drama in the comments down below. And I got a boxy charm. Look, I got this month's boxy charm. Um, I think I'm waiting. Should I do like a whole video on it, or should I like? Well, let me peek. Let me see. I don't know. Oh, we got some good stuff in here. Oh my god, I, I kind of want to do a video on it. Like, I kind of want to like show y'all what I got, but at the same time, I kind of feel like should I do a, a, a like a specific boxy charm video, or should I just do like put it in like a random video like towards the end, you know? But anyways. I don't know, I guess we'll wait. We'll wait and see what y'all got to say in the comments. But here's my boxy charm. If you don't have a boxy charm, I'll put my boxy charm code, affiliate code down below so that way I get a little taco money. See, put my little taco money purse. And then you guys get boxy charm, whatever. But I don't, I like it. I've been like, I've been having boxy charm for about a year now. Yeah, about a year now, and I freaking love it. A lot of the stuff are hits. There's a few misses every now and then, but majority of the time it's a hit, and that's what I like about it the most. Um, another beauty box, Tribe Beauty, they have a box too. That one's pretty good. And then uh, the Allure one is pretty good too. There's like, there's like the whole subscription box community on YouTube. Like, 
Seriously, that's the thing, right? People, they subscribe to all these boxes, girl, and they complain about what they got, what they didn't get, and the number drama the house. Okay, I'm gonna let you go, guys. If you like the video, smash that like button, comment, rate, subscribe. If you don't like the video, send to your haters so when they watch it, they lost 10 minutes of their life they'll never get back. And don't forget, I do have merchandise down below. Check it out if you want, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, I love you so much. So I'm using the random comment picker. I'm gonna enter the URL, and we're gonna load the comments. So this was the video that uh, the giveaway was a part of. So all you have to do is go ahead and comment something. And let me see, why is it not doing it? So, okay, there it goes. Loading 1,099 comments, um, 11 pages. Wow, and that was a Jeffree Star Valentine's Day Mystery Box 2019 video. All right, so here we go. Click button below to pick a winner. So randomly pick winner, pick the most like. We're not going to do that one. We're going to randomly pick winner. And here we go. All right. Love you and your video. So Brenda Chambers, you are the winner. You're on page three, comment 253. So message me. I got my email in the comments or in the description, and we'll go from there. Bye.